so here is my outfit i have this black blazer that i've just placed on my shoulders i feel like doing that makes an outfit look more stylish i don't know and then a black bodysuit i love bodysuits so much and then i have this plaid trouser that used to be so stylish a while back but then i got it from lc waikiki and i remember these jeans had us on a chalk hold literally everyone I knew owned one. They used to be so nice back in the day, but yeah, I still kept mine. By the way, do you know what? Um, a few months ago, this one would not have fit me, and I'm so glad I didn't give it away because it was a bit pricey. I remember when I got it, it was a bit pricey, of course, because they were like trending back then. So I decided to keep mine, and I'm so glad that it fits me. And then for my shoes, I have these white uh, sneakers. These are my errands shoes if you see this just know we mean business and then this is the bag that i am carrying and yeah that's my whole fit i love it it's simple and a bit cute i don't know <laughs> but yeah that's my outfit let's head out <laughs> Guys, I'm at budget wear and I saw this cut that looks so nice. I hope it fits me. I want to try this. It's so stylish. I love how it looks and then I also got this jumpsuit. I don't know if it will fit but let us try. Hey guys, I think it's small. <laughs> Small. Guys, the jumpsuit is big. I may have given up. I'm not going to try anything else. Guys, the person who will thrift this card will be so lucky. I think it's such a nice card. I think it needs like someone to be really, really skinny. But oh my god, I love that style. Throw up the sex in a uh -huh. And I can put you in I can put you in I've been a Throw up the sex in a I just got back home and I passed by Naivas and bought some donuts. Um, yeah, I just, I can't go to town and not come back home with something sweet to eat. <laughs> I have such a sweet tooth. But yeah, I want to make uh, some coffee or maybe tea. And then I take it with these donuts. I've really not decided what I'm going to have for dinner, but we'll see. I don't know what I'm going to eat, by the way. But yeah, this is... This is what I got. Also, by the way, when I was at um, Budget Wear, the one that is in town, I was able to thrift a few things. I had gone specifically to buy a white shirt because I have... Is this bodysuit? Is it a bodysuit? No, a jumpsuit that I bought a while back. And I feel like it would go well with like a oversized white shirt. So that's what I was looking for. 
but I ended up not buying it. Like I ended up not getting what I was looking for. Uh, so yeah, um, I think I'll show you what I thrifted tomorrow. And yeah. Guys, this is what I'm having for dinner. I'm having turmeric rice and then some beef on the side. As you can see, I had already started eating and then I remember that I'm a content creator. <laughs> but yeah, this is what I'm having for dinner. And then I don't know why I plated my food qua plastic bowl. But sometimes I just, I don't know, sometimes I just want something different, you know. So yeah, that's what I'm having. And then I have the blue lights on because I want to catch a movie. And yeah, I guess that's it for today. The next day. Hey, you guys. Welcome back to another day of um, this vlog. How's everybody doing? Today is on Sunday. Oh, do you guys think I should like hold my hair like this? I might just leave it like that. Yeah, let me just leave it like that. So yeah, today is on Sunday and like I said, I woke up quite late. <laughs> Going to church was not an option. But yeah, I think yesterday when we were hanging out, I was in town. I was at this shop called Budget Wear, the one that is in town. I think they have like a lot of branches in town. But that one specifically didn't have what I was looking for. One, I was looking for an oversized white shirt, Sikupata. I have this jumpsuit, yeah, that I want to wear with... <laughs> Let me try and put it straight. Um, yeah, I have this jumpsuit that I want. I just have an outfit in mind and I want um, to rock it one of these good days. So, Sikupata, unfortunately. So, I went to another budget wear. But then, am I the only one who doesn't like shopping cookie on our wengi? Like, I just don't get the freedom to shop properly. So, I left that budget wear and I went to another one. And this other one, still I didn't get my oversized shirt, but I was able to buy a few things because impasse buying, impasse buying. <laughs> so yeah, let me quickly show you what I thrifted and then I'm also going to put them on because I always find it fun that way. Like a clothing haul is not a clothing haul. I don't know. By the way, let's talk, before we get started, let's talk about this lip gloss. It's the one that I have on and I've been loving it so, so much. I got it from Uganda, from my friend in Uganda. She's the one who, like, she was using it and then was like, yeah, I'm going home with this. It's such a nice lip gloss. I love it so, so much. It's not turning my lips. So I don't know where to get, like, a nice lip gloss here in Kenya. And trust me, I have tried so many lip glosses. I'm thinking of getting one from Jumia, the one that Murugi Muni is always advertising. Did you need know, a lifter lip gloss from Maybelline? I don't know. I have tried so many lip glosses, especially from Du Bois. And yeah, I think at this point, anything that is going to your skin from Du Bois is not a good um, product. I think for the face, because I've been using like their body products and Zico Poa, but for the face, because tell me why I've been using this. As you can see, after it, it's it has not moved because every time I use it, my lips crack so much and they get dark instantly. And it's not a good look, honestly. It's not. So I used it for like a week and then I just stopped because honestly, it was not doing anything for my lips. And then I've also tried to use this squeeze and shine. This I've had so many reviews, especially on TikTok. Oh, the squeeze and shine lip gloss is the truth. But every time I use it, I get cracked lips. I don't know, guys. I don't know. So this is the only Atosunone Misha, it's the only lip gloss that is that is really looking like a nice lip gloss. But yeah, let me quickly show you the things that I thrifted because at this point I'm going to talk. I can talk, guys. I can talk. I can talk. Alright, so the first thing that I thrifted is this um what is this called? A tank top? Yeah, a tank top with this cow neck design at the front goes all the way down i wish this was like a bodysuit it would look so nice i'm obsessed with bodysuits guys i think by now you know but yeah i love the color totally looks nice it stretches as well such a beautiful uh tank top is this a tank top a tank top a top i don't know i think it's a tank top <laughs> but yeah the second top i got is a bodysuit <coughs> And it looks like this it's pink in color i love this blush pink so much and then this the way that it's carved 
lovely lovely i love it so so much it's a bodysuit as you can see like i said i have so many bodysuits oh my god so this is another bodysuit that i got it has like a lavender color that's how it looks like yeah bodysuit and then the details yeah this is what i love the most about it it will look so nice i can't wait to put it on for you guys so that you can see so yeah those are the tops that i thrifted oh i also have another top um this one looks like this i love this color by the way and then this also stretches i love the material guys can you see the material yeah this is such a nice top what else so the other thing i got is a dress This is just a blue dress. It looks like this. This you will not be able to see it properly unless I wear it. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. The other thing that I thrifted was a dress. Actually, this one is from H&M. And this is such a nice dress, guys. I want someone to take me for vacation. I want someone to take me for vacation because... Yeah, we need to wear it somewhere and let me show you the details at the back bam can you all see this is so cute it looks so nice and then it has like a slit in the front and this other side i'll show you nikiva because right now i don't think you guys can see it and then the last thing i got is this um half coat yeah i think that's what they, they are called i have been looking for such a half coat for the longest time and what i loved most about this is how it looks yeah i love this so so much i love it and i cannot wait to style it for you guys guys remember me yo hey 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 yeah i'm a raruka but me please the dog i can always take it kafundi but then you know what i had someone say that thrifting is all fun and games until you're called to a formal place and now you don't have anything to wear and i totally agree like i ha i do have clothes but the way i struggle sometimes to like put on to come up with an outfit because certainly we thrifted like of course thrifting is very affordable it's quite cheap affordable it's affordable but time ya poa ikifika he uta struggle so i think i need to like you know be switching it be switching it up with like uh new clothes you know yeah so that at least i can have something to wear whenever i have something important to do so yeah that's what's up let us fit the clothes and i'm going to fit them the way i would style them yeah that makes more sense yeah let's get started uh let me try to look for motivation because i'm bored right now Guys, I need to do this quickly because my phone is dying, but that's the first top. I absolutely love it. And then I've paired it with these black jeans. I'm sorry, I feel like uh, skinny jeans will never go out of style, at least in my closet. The way they just go well with everything, especially black ones. So yeah, I've just paired it with these black uh, jeans and that's how the top looks like totally love the details in the front and yeah so um the second top looks like this fits like a glove i love it so so much such a cute top and it fits me as you can see i've still paired it with the same jeans because we've said what skinny jeans are always the way to go all right you guys so this is the third fourth top and this is how it looks like i knew this top would look this nice like i just knew because of the color see how the color is popping it looks so so nice i love it and yeah on to the fifth top all right guys it's actually getting darker outside that's why the quality looks like this but this is the other top that you saw earlier um yeah nothing major to it it's just a simple basic bodysuit but i love it i love it so much again i've paired it with the black jeans because yeah like we've said black skinny jeans goes so well with everything 
I had completely forgotten to show you this um, half coat, but this is how it looks like. I absolutely love it. Um, yeah, I've been thinking of getting some boots so that I can pair it with this. It would look so cute. I love it. Love, love it. So guys, this is the last item. Absolutely love it. It goes all the way down. It's just a normal black dress, but I need to go on vacation because this is such a cute find. And yeah, it has some slits on this side and this other side. And yeah, now my phone is dying. Let me um charge it and then we'll continue the vlog tomorrow. The next day. doing uh huh i want to finish up with this vlog today the weather doesn't look that great i also have another sit down that i want to do just today 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 we are being productive as productive as possible um yeah i was watching tmi tmi but yeah uh before we finish up oh i still have like a few things that i need to do before we finish up but yeah let's get into it um so i wanted to put you on this two perfumes that i recently bought i actually bought them yesterday oh let me tell you these perfumes are the truth they're actually dupes for like um designer perfumes i didn't even know i had to google this shit and i was shocked honestly when i was buying them that's not what i had in mind i just saw something that looked actually this is the one that i saw and it was looking like the packaging looks cute so i was like let me smell it and i loved it i loved it mm. I'm not good at um, describing scents, obviously, but this this has a fresh scent, like a clean scent. I don't know how to explain. Like, you know those body washes and yes, nanukianga, like just freshness. Uh, yeah, that's what it smells. That's the best I can do, guys. We CG Mamboya notes, CG Nini Nini. Those ones, I don't know. But this, oh my god, this smells so good. <sighs> So this this is a dupe of Lancome La Vies Bell. I know I've butchered that name, but yeah, I'll place the original perfume on the screen. So this is like the dupe. So if you ever come across such perfumes, Usiziache, by the way, these are the real deal. And you know what's funny? When I smelled this, it reminded me of another perfume I had smelled, Nikia West Lands. What's the name of that show? I don't remember. I'll place it on the screen. So what I did was I went inside and I was like, you know what? I've seen people hyping like this perfume so much. Let me go in and see like if I would like the smell of this perfume. So I smelled them and of course I couldn't afford it. <laughs> Cause tell me why a perfume is 30,000. So I just smelled and I went back home. So when I smelled this yesterday, I was like, this reminds me so much of that particular perfume that I smelled that time. So when I started googling Kumbe, googling, is googling a word? When I, when I went to Google, <laughs> when I went to Google, I saw like this is like a dupe for that particular perfume. What a coincidence. So yeah, I just wanted to put it on guys. If you ever come across uh, this type of perfume, Zinatorty Power Pulse. This is how it looks like I, this smells so good like i i don't know between the two of them which i love the most like i don't know which i love the most i tried using them yesterday at night and even today in the morning they were still smelling on my body i just wanted to test them out neona if they are like long lasting because there is nothing as amazing as a perfume that is long lasting right and i feel like this this smells so good on my body this smells good in your bottle but this one on my body I'm about to smell like an expensive woman, y'all. On a budget. 
on a budget <coughs> guys whoa, whoa, whoa. yani it smells so good and i'm not even capping like what ah, i feel like i just stumbled upon a, a gold mine like i will be buying this i will be buying this do you know what when i bought them i even went back to see if they had like others <laughs> And unfortunately, they only had two of them. I tried looking on Jumia, and on Jumia, can you imagine one was going for a thousand bob? No ways, because tell me why I got like the two of them for 600, one was going for 300, 300. So, and then on Jumia, one is going for a thousand bob. So, mm. I want to place them like this so that you guys can clearly see. So, in case you're ever looking for like a dupe for like a designer perfume get this get this and thank me later so as you can see the mandico power pulse and then this one is to sadi donna and then lavier laviest ball or whatever <laughs> but yeah guys i wanted to show you uh some fairy lights that i got let me put them on so that you can see how beautiful is this and it goes all the way up there like it's quite long so it fits my window you can't clearly see now because nimchana i will show you during the night oh my god it's such a vibe such a vibe i'm so happy and i feel they also go well because of my sheer curtains my sheer curtains are like really light as you can see so ata zikiwa usiku zinonekana which i love you guys i'm going to show you usiku ndio muone i love i love them i love them Especially now because uh ingia time ya Christmas, this will come so much in handy. so i'm at my friend's place and i want to make some pilau it's actually raining outside so let me do this quickly before it rains heavily and then you can't hear me so yeah i've already made my kachumbari and then some onions these are the onions that i will be using to make my pilau i've already um what is it called squashed <laughs> some ginger and garlic and then these are all the um spices i'll be using guys you know that i'm very heavy on spices and then also some royco cubes but then these royco cubes you can either use them or not but i just like a lot of spices in my food so we have soy sauce pilau masala mixed spices chilies 
Um, and yeah, by the way, when you're making your pilau, you don't have to include everything that I'm including. The only thing that is essential, I think, is pilau masala, ginger, and garlic. But for me, like I've said, I am very heavy on spices. So, yeah, that's everything that I'll be using. Let's get on with the cooking. So this is the pan that I used to boil my meat. My meat is ready. I've removed it and then I've just added some onions and then I'll add some oil. Alright you guys, so my food is ready. It looks so good. Let me serve. Food is ready. Mpishi mm? hodari. Listen. <laughs> I'm such a cook, by the way. I'm such a cook. But yeah, that's um my food. Let me devour and then we'll catch up later. 
by the way guys in case you're wondering my friend is actually sleeping she has a hangover so yeah but remember she has food like amka she'll just have what is left oh my god this food is so nice oh my goodness you guys i'm such a cook <laughs> uh imagine i just took this phone to just brag the food is really slapping it really is